<laughs> I'm too shy. <laughs> Hi guys, my name is Michelle and I create hair, makeup and lifestyle content here on YouTube. Today I'm showing you three very very simple hairstyles under five minutes. <laughs> With me I have Anka here. Say hi Hello. Anka. <laughs> so yeah, if you want to see how to get three super basic hairstyles under five minutes, then keep watching. <laughs> All right, so today I have my model Anka with me and I'm gonna start off by taking some of her front sections and I'm leaving these sections out to just frame her face. I'm just gonna take some pieces of hair from her crown section and I'm gonna be very superficial about this section of hair, which means to say that I'm only gonna take top sections and I'm not gonna take all of the hair above the ear. And then I'm just gonna take all of the hair and give it a little twist. I'll lift up slightly to add a bit of volume and I'm also gonna finesse around the hair so that it looks nice and flat at the crown and then I'm just gonna secure the hairstyle using some u-shaped pins add as many pins as you want you can also spray the pins with some hairspray so that it gives you nice hold but I didn't do it in this case since we have curly hair it is very easy to shape and mold the hair just make sure that you're hiding all of the pins and nothing is visible and you should be good to go. So lift whenever you feel necessary. And this is gonna give you some really nice crown volume. So yep, this is your first hairstyle. I mean, how simple was that? Now let's check, does Anka like this hairstyle? Well, maybe, uh, she's not sure. But she'll give us a turn anyway. No, seriously guys, such an easy hairstyle. It is so pretty and elegant. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. Now for the second hairstyle, I'm just gonna take some of the curl clumps from the front and I'm just gonna keep them out to frame the face nicely. And then from the right and the left, I'm just gonna take a few slices of hair. Okay, let me just turn her around so that you can see what this looks like from behind. But yeah, I'm just gonna take two slices of hair from the right and the left, and then I'm just gonna crisscross them and bring them to the center at the back of the head. Smooth everything down. If you feel like you want to go in with a mixture of gel and water so that you have no frizzy sticking out, please do that. But in the case of Anka, it was not really necessary. So yeah, I'm just smoothing the hair pieces down so that they look nice and pretty. And then I'm just gonna use this beautiful pin to hold the hair together. I got this set of clips from Amazon. They were a set of four. I'll link them in the bottom bar, so please check them out. I'm gonna hide the unwanted parts of the clip by just adjusting the hair and tucking them inside. And guys, this is the hairstyle. Having some accessories in your collection can really enhance your hairstyles for you. And look, Anka really seems to like this one. Guys, isn't she doing a fantastic job? What a beautiful, pretty hairstyle and it quite literally took me no time at all. So for my third hairstyle, I'm gonna use some golden bobby pins. I'm gonna leave some face framing sections in front and then I'm just gonna take some slices of hair from the top section and then again I'm gonna crisscross but this time I'm gonna take the sections one by one. So I'm taking the section from the left and bringing it to the right and I'm gonna see where the section is going to land. I'm gonna take hair just above the place where the section lands and then I'm just gonna lift that hair up. I'll just move that out of the way and just spin it up using a claw clip for now. This is really going to help me understand where to put my pin so that I can hide it under the hair. So I'm taking that hair and bringing it to the center but I'm taking it slightly off center on the right and then I'm just taking a pin, a tic tac clip if you will and then I'm just securing the hair in place. Spread the hair out nicely so that again it looks like a slice of hair nice and neat. Then I'm taking that exact section that I used to hide the pin and I'm bringing that section of hair down and pushing it towards the left, again slightly off-center. 
I'm going to take another tic tac clip and this is not going to be part of the hairstyle per se. I'm going to just use this as a placeholder for the actual hairstyle. Now I'd say use a tic tac clip because generally they're easy to put on and take off. So you won't have any trouble with them. Also, it is very easy to bend and maneuver hair when you're using a tic tac clip. So it makes sense. After that, I'm going to take my gold bobby pins and then very gently, I'm going to put it through the section of hair. So it is going into the slice of hair, if you will. The bobby pins are now going to go in a line and what this is going to do is really give that slice of hair some structure and this is going to make the hair very malleable, bendable, don't know what you want to call it but yeah the hair is going to be very easy to manipulate. We can take the bobby pins and move them slightly on top, slightly at the bottom and the hair as in the slice of hair is going to be so easy to manipulate and put into place. So I'm going to place the bobby pins at equal distances from each other so they'll be equidistant. Yeah, I stand by that word. They're going to be equidistant. And it doesn't matter how many pins you're using, you can really separate them and cover a large area or you can just keep these closer to the center. It's completely up to your aesthetics. So yeah, one by one, I'm just taking those bobby pins and placing them into the slice of hair in a straight line. Well, as straight as possible. This is going to give you such a chic, elevated look. And as we know, these bobby pins, this trend is really happening. K-pop is really popularizing the trend of bobby pins. So by all means, it doesn't have to be gold. You can go crazy with different colors. I've seen quite a lot of colored bobby pins on Amazon. Take my advice and get yourself some bobby pins. You can do so much with them. In fact, I'm going to make so many videos, maybe here, maybe on Instagram, let's see, featuring these bobby pins in these crazy styles. This style is more elegant and classic. So I wanted to start with this in keeping with the entire theme of this video. But yeah, you get the picture. Isn't that such a gorgeous hairstyle? Okay, I'm going to make Anka turn so that you can see the hair having that little lift at the crown. It is so beautiful. This is such a beautiful hairdo for a bridal or maybe for like a bridesmaid's look. It is so simple. It is so easy and effective. So yup guys, uh, hopefully you liked all of these hairstyles. Sound off in the comments down below. All right, guys, that was it. Three <laughs> super simple hairstyles under five minutes. Uncle, would you say it took about five minutes? Um, I think less than five minutes. I think two <laughs> minutes, maybe. It was super amazing. <laughs> Did you like the hairstyles? Oh, I love them. Do you, would you replicate <laughs> these at home? I will definitely try. Definitely. <laughs> or I'm coming to you and you're going to do it for me. <laughs> I have the expert. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. All right. Anyway, so... That was it. That was the video. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed Anka. All right. If you like these hairstyles, give us a thumbs up. If you want to see more from me, uh, follow me on Instagram because I post a lot there that you won't see here. All right, guys. That was it. I will see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>